This is PXX RPG Queen, otherwise known as Hikari Silver, bringing you guys another amazing Let's Play. In the last episode, we ran all over the place in this magical city and encountered such, such, such bullshit and so many annoying creatures. But now we've met Savian, the weird, creepy stoner stalker dude that's been watching roads for like 11,000 years. And now we gotta do tests and give him some of our courage because apparently he has none left after watching Rose for that many years. And she's not creeped out by it. So let's go ahead and continue on. Shall we start the first challenge? Now I will make an extra special um, because if you give the wrong answers, you'll make psychedelic bomb and moot still, but it won't be a repeatable item. Here are all the right answers. You'll make psychedelic bomb and it will be a repeatable item. And then I'll show you what happens when you get all the answers wrong and all that stuff in the extras, okay? It seems like it's just us. Why don't we fight for starters? Are you scared because you lost many times? Or is it the cheap pride of a giganto stopping you? Kongu and Rose change. Rose doesn't say such things. You are not Rose. Then die. Don't tell me you are buddying up with your enemy. You fool, what happened to my plan? The unification of Endonez. Have you found the leader who replaced me? So, do not swing your axe. Take the sword. Emperor Dole, Kongu got new feeling. Kongu found new friends. Intention of Emperor Dole is in Kongu. Kongu won't avoid Emperor Dole. Okay. We saw the courage of a giganto. Real courage can be obtained when a person is released from the bonds of the past. I, uh, I didn't. I, the challenges that I don't like are basically hashels and congles and darts. You'll see why. There's not really much commentary I'll give on that p perspective, but that's just how it is with me. I see. You're giving me a challenge. Let's get it over with. Don't be so hasty, Uck. Miranda, you're hasty. Have a short temper and are hopelessly annoying, Uck. You really have a short temper, Uck. I have a question for annoying Miranda, Uck. Why are you here? Okay. So, when you're asked why you're here, you should say for the world. To save the world from annihilation. I asked the wrong question. All were right, Uck. Buckle lost, Uck. Miranda won, Uck. I lost, so Buckle die, Uck. What are you talking about? Without Buckle, this space cannot exist. You die too, Miranda. Where am I? Buckle, answer me. You don't still don't understand, Uck. Buckle and Miranda died, Uck. Don't tell me I died. I'm still alive. Look, I still have my hands and feet. To die is to vanish, Uck. Now Miranda vanishes, Uck. Same as Buckle, Uck. What kind of trick is this? What did you do with my body? Miranda has done enough, Uck, so that you vanish with Buckle, Uck. Are you scared, Uck? Afraid, Uck? Wanna cry, Uck? Now, Miranda answer is I'm ready for death anytime, but the real answer is I cannot die now. And Buckle is a really big asshole, by the way. I cannot die now. I haven't done anything yet. I cannot die if terror remains in the world. Miranda is revived, Uck. Buckle is revived too, Uck. Oh, great. Buckle's mean. The person who knows the time of their own death has real courage. Hmm. <laughs> that means I too have. Alright, let's do Albert's test next. But Buckle's really mean. Your Majesty Albert, it's an emergency. 
Minister Noish, why are you here? I was called by Mr. Savian. Sidereal's in danger. Tell me more. The mysterious Eastern tribe is deploying an army around the border. In cowardice, they took advantage of your absence, King. Return to Indal's castle at once. Your people are waiting for you to come back, Your Majesty. You can't do that. I cannot do that. Why? I am a dragoon before I am a king. Minister Noish, please attend to the matter of the invasion by the Eastern tribe. Do everything possible to avoid a fight. That's right. Don't worry. There is no such thing as an Eastern tribe. But duh, we would have found out about it, like, in disc one. That's our king. Albert had to weigh the world's crisis against his peoples, but making cool choices is the responsibility of a king. The real leader has to be able to weigh the effects of his death. That is the courage of a king. Like, Sadie's a sick bastard at this point. Like, he's really a sick bastard. Such a sick bastard playing these mind games. Nothing is here. Boring. Bardell? Why are you here? I came back from the infernal world to get revenge for my sister. You are interrupting me, Gura. Gura? You told me, Miru, you would come back to settle the matter of his sisters after the journey. So you cannot die here. Make amends with your death. My sister admired you. How can you still live after taking the life of my sister? Still can't die. I still cannot die. I cannot do anything if I die, even make amends. It was tough, wasn't it? Poor Miru. Death does not make amends. Making amends only exists in life. We surely saw the courage of Miru who knew and chose to live. Like he's really a sick bastard. We are starting the next challenge. Sorry there's not that much commentary for me on the test of Savian. It's just really fucked up. That's it. The completion of magic requires both the material and heart of the person who uses it. It is like raising disciples. Oh boy. This flashback again, Hashel, you got to, like, forgive yourself. He is not forgiving himself for that, is he? Kind of hard to. Ouch. What is this? And Clara left Rogue. I saw it through the mirror with Spino. If you could erase all your memories and could go back to that moment, could you stop Claire? I couldn't stop her. It was the best I could do. That's right. Accepting the past, it shows courage too. I don't know if Hashel completely accepts his past. We are starting the next challenge. Alright. Of course we gotta do Rose. Wonder how this is gonna go. I would often think about it. The thing we are doing, namely, Charlie creating the signet spear to seal the moon that never sets, and Rose continuously killing the moon child. 
I prepared for the coming evil day with a new signet moot and the psychedelic bomb, and waited until the moment. The road to destruction laid by the creator soul was supposed to be absolute, but evolution was stopped by us wingleys. I would often think about it. Whether our deeds were the right thing and will continue forever. I am afraid. Whether I'll be myself until the day my body perishes and becomes dust. Will our intentions be engulfed by the intention of the Creator Soa, eventually? Is everything meaningless? You go too far. We are neither immortal nor gods, we are mere people. People should just live in the present, because it means living for the next present. I've been that way, and I won't change. When is my challenge? Rose don't need no stinking test, cause she's Rose. And she's clearly courageous enough. We have finished the challenge to six. You are the last one, Dart. Are you ready for the last challenge? So, okay. It's the last! Pour your courage into the psychedelic bomb. Okay. Dark's test is messed up on several different levels. Shauna? Is this an illusion? It's the possibility of the future. The sword! I, I cannot control my body! What did you do to me? You have to take up swords against Shauna. Stop it! Shauna is the moon child that gives birth to the god of destruction, as well as being Dart's significant other. If you have to take up swords against Shauna, what are you gonna do? Now, don't be a bitch and say you don't know what to do. I will save Shauna no matter what. That's courage. It is the possibility of future, but I don't think Dart will have a floating Shauna in front of him saying, what are you gonna do? The courage to pursue your love will even change fate. Savian went ahead to see the results. I hope our courage will be able to make the psychedelic bomb. It's the creation from thousands of years of effort by Savian. We have a huge responsibility. We obtained an unexpected ally. Now we can wait for Zeke at the Signet Spear. We all know what that means, don't we? If we can stop my dad in the city, the world will be saved. That's it. Let's go. Savian's waiting. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna be that easy. Alright. Rebuilding party time. Um, this would probably be the party you'll have for a while, so... Miranda, for now. Um... Any level 30 person would do, but honestly, since Miru hasn't finished her edition, we'll keep her in. Off we go to see if our courage was timely and great enough, which I think it was. The path to saving is not that hard. Cool. Darn it. Darn it, darn it, darn it, darn it, darn it, darn it. Why do jellies continuously attack me? I've been nice and have not put on heat blade. As tempting as that may be. Like I said, I can do Miru's edition without um, Ultimate War Guide, but it just makes my life easier. Somewhat. And I just want to get her addition out of the way. Yeah. But seeing as she has healing powers, I might change the party later. Yes. Go. Go, Miru. Yeah. 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 That's right, Miru. Cat's Cradle. You know it was really power powerless. This is probably not the best party. In retrospect. It is the fastest party because M Miru's in it. Not even the fastest party. At least it stopped. Yes! Go! Great. Yeah! 
hopefully we have Miru's edition done soon. And let's be real about it. They're not gonna stop Zeke here. Like if it, if they did, then this game would be really short. But not a spoiler. Ouch. Ouch. Fuck this shit. I'm changing Dart's weapons. You should probably you should have probably put Heat Blade on in the beginning in the last video, but eh, it is what it is. Okay. We're gonna change some stuff. Now, mind you, Soul Eater is his most powerful weapon. His second most powerful weapon would be Fairy Sword. So, that helps. Uh, Miranda has therapy ring, but Miru should be fine. She has Angel's robe, and if she dies, we'll figure it out. Yeah, all of these places lead to the same thing. Ooh, light's pretty. Look, the courage of all of you is adding up. The new magic will be born. Give me your hands. Give me your hands to save the world. This is the psychedelic bomb? Oh my god. It is exceeding the limit. Did it fail? Don't worry, it's not a bad thing. Your courage was too strong. My ultimate magic is now completed. Look at the babies, the weird little babies. Savian, at last I finished the preparation of Moot Ruff. It was rough, rough. Our efforts will pay off you. Magic power is as strong as the signet spears is gathered in Moot Few. It seems we made it in time. Does this mean we can stop my father's plan? As long as he doesn't destroy Mootoof. It's okay, Feel. The strongest of all magic creatures, Last Kraken, is guardian it, Feel. Let's activate Moot at once. We will put a new seal on the moon that never sets. So, if you remember what I was saying earlier, even if you get half of the questions wrong, you'll make Psychedelic Bomb. Psychedelic Bomb X is Psychedelic Bomb, but it's a repeatable item, which is more awesome. So, now we're good to go. Like, for future boss battles and everything with Psychedelic Bomb. It's a non-elemental. Now here, all you have to do is follow Savian. Which is awesome, right? So you won't get lost. But, the last Kraken is the thing that's guarding everything. So keep that in mind. My extras video will be interesting. It'll be interesting. Go, Dart. Yeah, kill it with your fire magic. I'm tired of this bullshit. We don't need body purifier. We should not. Not here. Like, there's not. The animals here don't really give status ailments. Body purifier, bye bye. But. Psych Bomb X. It's unbased, so it's a non elemental attack. But that's not what I want. Not paying attention. My bad, guys. Okay. Now, let's get that trust, see what's in it. Woo, money was worth it. Angelus is so pretty, though. Healing Breeze. Neat. Following Savian makes it so much easier. Okay, so I'm gonna end the Let's Play right here, guys. As always, like, comment, and subscribe to my channel, like my Facebook page, follow me on Twitter, and check out my blog, and stay tuned for next time when we basically head into a boss battle.